in a car with, say your name. Darcy. <laughs> <laughs> and you may remember me, I'm Chow. <laughs> um, so Darcy has found some questions that he would like to ask me, which, you know, anyone can be involved that is in this here vehicle. Oh, yep, thanks so for that, Ayla. You're so generous. We're just going to shoot and hope that you can hear. So I am, excuse the fact that I'm yelling at the camera, but you know. So, my first question for you, Ailish, is what is the most ridiculous thing that you have ever bought? And this is actually a question for everybody, obviously. Mm, I have to think, actually. Yeah, and they're, they're quite thinking questions, so you can do lots of editing. That'd be good. I can't wait. I bought uh, Healy's. You bought Healy's? Like oh, about, that's so good. Like about a month ago. Oh, that's oh, so good. Oh, that's massive. <laughs> that's yeah. fantastic. Why don't you wear them? Because uh, they're super impractical. They are actually a really just uncomfortable shoe. What's the quality you value the most in a friend? Mm. So difference, differences between like friend and like romantic partner, like different qualities. Let's talk about God. Well, we've got time. Well, we're we'll going through it. People will lose interest. My main audience is right here though in this car. That's true. Very true. Woo. Woo. Uh, oh, us. Go team Ailish. We were the OG. Just remember us when you get famous. <laughs> if you like a romantic partner, I would put like honesty and communication at number one. But not for a friend. <laughs> for um, they can lie to you, that's fine. No, it's not fine, but I don't think it's as... Uh, like, it's a not friend a doesn't breaker. have to tell me like absolutely everything that's going on in their life and we can still have a fun time, you know what I mean? Yep. That's um, not fair play. In a friend... I'm that gonna... guy was going like 140 k's with his phone right in here. Oh, no. That's not good. Just, just, I said just, as I'm just... filming a video right now while I'm driving. How crazy would it be if we crashed and that was on video? Okay, did you not? <laughs> Can you not? That's not cool. <laughs> that would be mental. Me, <laughs> me. <laughs> 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 one but spontaneity and having a bit of fun like willingness or like even like just like like to surprise you with stuff yeah that's something that's something that i really 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 like and something you don't get very often with a lot of people agreed really and i think i think i think good friends that's a really good thing as well but i think in a relationship that's like yeah bang. i think for both friends and romantic my other top is just fun yeah. i just want to be out of fun you know but yeah. i think yeah i think just doing things that are unexpected like just doing new stuff all the time. Just walk in, crucial. into your house and there's just like llamas or something. That's like your... That sounds like the best thing ever. Like, seriously. <sighs> I would drop to my knee and propose to anyone if I walked <laughs> into my llamas. house and they bought me llamas. Uh, I know the way to cool. Cal's heart. Okay. <laughs> most interesting... I wanted to make it as vague as possible. Most interesting childhood memory. Oh, yeah, I've got this one. Okay. When I was a young... Last, my family went on holiday to this little cottage in the countryside, um, and I was too young at the time to play tennis. But I have two older brothers no, and, next my, question. <laughs> and my parents, and so they went to play tennis, and I was just left to wander around the, the farm fields. And there was all of these sheep, and what I discovered was that there was a huge shaft, like a huge ditch in the ground, huge, like a big deep Habits? ditch. This is like Batman. Batman falling into the well. Huge. And I look down. Batman fell into a well. Yeah, he did. Uh -huh. Go on, fell into a bat cave. Well, well, and I well. look down into this ditch, and there is a lamb, a little starving lamb. And that's why it's called Mary had a little lamb. Because I was gonna bring up. Because <laughs> now Mary. it's down a well. Go on, go on. And so, and it was, it was so cute, but it was clearly like gonna die. <laughs> Big issue. And so what I did was I grabbed some grass and I was throwing the grass down the little um <laughs> helpful crevasse. <laughs> so you buried this poor lamb alive. <laughs> go on, keep going. No, and it was eating the grass and I made oh, little nice. I barred at it and it would bar back. Bam. I'm not even kidding. It would bar, bar back. <laughs> 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 Very good. 
Oh, bang. It's actually it's funny, sensual. sheep actually do bar back when you yeah. bar them. Yes. It's amazing. Bar back so sheep. Good. Yes, oh, bar. It's are... like back. Bar, bar, bar. Oh, and you were yelling at the sheep. Can everyone be quiet? Bar. 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 Walking around this little sheep. I'm not kidding. Like, this was such a huge operation. And pull it out of the mine shaft. <laughs> Lifted up, <laughs> literally, and then so we rescued a, sh a little lamb. But then what happened? And then we went there, looked at the mother, take the way, the way, and we look up on this hill, and this tiny little starving lamb approached its mother and began suckling from its teat upon a hill. And it was honestly like the end of an after school special. And that is oh, my story. That's a really nice ending. Yeah, that's cool. I'm pretty sure no one else can top that, so we should just move on to the next one. I'm happy to move on. Right, where is your favorite place on earth? Disneyland. Really? Yeah. Next to you. Uh, yours? No you guys? What about yours? What's yours? Home. Yeah, you'd think yeah, you'd think of home, really. Oh. I don't always want to be home, but coming home is always amazing. Yeah. Yeah. You know? Um, what artist or band do you always recommend when somebody asks you for a music recommendation? This is a good one. Oh, um, so it obviously depends a lot on like what they're into and stuff, but like, like yeah. just overall, what's like your favorite? What, what would you recommend? Jamie yeah. Cullum. Yeah. Oh yeah. And also Waves. Go oh, check no, out I Waves. Said. You recommended Waves. To me. Waves with a double V. How good is Waves? Yes. Yes. How good? I'm There's so much fun. Say, yeah, it totally depends on. Oh, and also Tom Mish. Yeah. Those are my top three. Catfish the Bottleman with yeah, Drew Darcy. That was yeah. I know everyone will love them. It's just so much fun listening to them. Vampire Weekend oh, okay, cool. and Grimes. Gregory Porter and Fleet Foxes, I think. Before we had music to recommend, what if you had one um, movie recommendation? What would it be? Midnight in Paris, Owen Wilson. Midnight wow. in Paris, genuinely. <laughs> Gotta be Shawshank. I watched it the other night with a friend of mine and with her two housemates. And we were, we're, we're like... I really love About a Boy. I think that is such a fun film and not everyone has seen it. Yeah, yes. Great, great so book too. Good, yes. The Grand Budapest Hotel because it's the Amazing. best movie ever. Oh, movie. I should watch that. Incredible film. Also, House Moving Castle because then I, they'll get like into Ghibli films. So it'll be a great time. Memento. Oh, oh great film. Great. Memento's not that scary. I changed my answer. Predestination is about time travel. That's cool. Right, so anyway, we're going to keep it. I changed it. Go on. What to get it? out. I've not seen Get Out. Everyone needs to see Get Out. It is amazing. Oh, have you seen it? Well, then how dare you have? I'm such too scared an to see it. No, 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 no. See, listen, I cannot deal with scary films, but I Get Out was okay. It's okay, not. That's fine. It's it's just. It's just intense. It's just psychologically thrilling, but it's not too scary. Uh, thank you. That concludes this video. That's everyone, the end. everyone, how would you rate? No, stop. How would you rate your experience during this? I'm I give it a nine. Well, Tell my stories weren't appreciated, so I'm gonna rate it a eight point five. Cool, <laughs> I thought still my pretty fate, good. My least favorite parts of the parts with Ailish was like, oh no, I'm so scared about all this editing I'm going through. <laughs> but apart from that, it was really fun. <laughs> wow, and and John? Oh, probably like a, a eight point eight. Three? He's, trying to, he's just trying to outdo me. Thanks so much for being a part of it, even yeah. though I yeah, I guess you really have a choice because you're in the car, so you just yeah. had to be. And um, you're all so by. And now I have to work out all the petrol money that's owed me. This Thanks for watching. This is great. Have a nice day. I'll see you. <laughs>